So today we're at Ripley Castle, which is about five miles north of Harrogate. Oh, a bit of a bang going on over there. Shooting. Ah, shooting. There we go. So we're currently in the deer park at the moment. We've just walked through part of the gardens and we're going to walk through the walled gardens a bit later on. Ripley Castle's got a little bit of a, a colourful history, I guess, uh, sort of. Um, Around about 800 years ago, uh, the son of Sir Thomas Ingleby, who was the owner at the time, he actually saved the king uh, from getting gorged by a wild boar. So that was quite interesting. And he actually got he got knighted, he got made a sir. And then he actually got given uh, a wild boar as one of his uh, insignia that he used on his coat of arms. Also, the, the owners were implicated in the gunpowder plot as well. As the owner at the time actually put up the gunpowder plotters uh, as they were waiting to procure horses to make their way down to London. Um, also, the the owner of Ripley uh, Castle uh, supported King Charles I during the English Civil War and was one of the leaders at Marston Moor. Uh, and at Marston Moor, the, the royalist uh, army were actually routed at Marston Moor. Then Oliver Cromwell then later spent a couple of nights at Ripley Castle while the, the owner at the time of Ripley Castle had to spend the night in a, in a priest hall. So that's quite interesting. So we're just going to have a look around the castle, we're going to have a look around the deer park. I'm not sure if we're going to see any deers or not. But yeah, it's a really weird, quite a warm day, but also quite cloudy, very muggy. Yeah, I'd say it's muggy. So yeah, oh there's some gooses over there. So we're going to go and have a look at the gooses. So yeah, we'll just show you around. Um, yeah, and thanks for watching and let's just enjoy ourselves at Ripley Castle. <laughs> So the last time we came to uh, Ripley Castle, there was actually the Ripley, was it the Ripley show? Ripley show. Ripley show. And this field here was just full of piggies and sheepies and all sorts of animals. I actually did do a bit of a video that day, but I don't think I ever actually put it up in the end. So yeah, I might have, I probably put some pictures on, on the Instagram. We're seeing plenty of uh, gooses and ducks at the moment waterfowl not seen any any deer yet unfortunately plenty of <laughs> plenty of deer poo um although there's not as much here but yeah um so entry it, it was it's normally seven pounds per person for an, adult. for an adult yeah i'm not sure how much price is cheaper. I don't know how much yeah it's price. yeah it's a bit cheaper um so yeah at the moment it's two adults 11 pounds 50 um yeah and you have to book a slot the slots seem to be every 15 minutes um but as you can see there's there's nobody else here really i think we saw a couple when we came in um and we haven't seen anybody else the cafe is open as well so we're gonna probably have a bit of a coffee a tea room, a tea room. it's not a cafe it's a tea room that's what we call because yeah because we're in north yorkshire now i think like i said ripley castle is about five miles north of harrogate so you know, it's a fancy part of Yorkshire, so... It's it... Harrogate Post, I believe. 
Yeah, it probably is. That's where Harrogate Gin's based. Yeah, Harrogate Gin's based here, so... They do Harrogate Gin experiences at the entrance, and it's... Oh, I don't have a deer. Oh, we've, have we seen a deer? Let's get some more on that tree. Oh, there it is, yeah. We've got some canoes over here. I don't know. I've never seen canoes on the water, but there are some boys on there, so... I presume at some point in the year... Experiences. Experiences. Yeah, so pre-Covid, you could come here and they did experiences, so they did... They do stuff like um, clay pigeon shooting and stuff like that. Um, I think there's something similar to go ape somewhere on the estate, I think. Oh, the deer's under the tree now, ain't they? We've got a deer under the tree. Yeah, it's eating. I don't know if we'll be able to make that out on the camera, but it's, it's there. It's there. Yeah, so if you're in the area and you fancy coming to a country estate and you want to see, unfortunately you can't go inside Ripley Castle at the moment, then there you go, £11.50 for two adults. You have to book a 15 minute slot. And it's all good. So I think we're just going to keep having a wander around. Probably go to the tea room. But yeah, I'd recommend if you're in the North Yorkshire area, come in to check it out. And you could probably bring a picnic if it was a bit of a nicer day. Just be careful of all the deer poo. We're just finishing up, having a walk around the walled garden, have a look at some of the logan berries that seem to be coming out. The kitchen garden, yeah, we're just having a having a look at the berries in the kitchen garden. So yeah, we're just going to now take a few pictures, um, and then we're going to head into the tea room. It's not a cafe; it's a tea room, apparently. It's what I've been told. So we're just going to take a few pictures, put that on our Instagram. So in the meantime, thanks for watching this short video. Definitely do come to Ripley Castle and check it out if you want a relaxing day looking at the gardens, hopefully seeing some deers. So in the meantime, I'll see you again in the next video. Mm -hmm.